In this video, I'm gonna share with you how you can get absolutely screaming nano A-gap pressure at the quarterback in Madden 22. Now, if you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe button. Also, if you are brand new to the channel, make sure you turn on those notifications. That way you don't miss any of these important uh, videos. We release new videos on the channel every single day, and this might be one of the most important videos that we've released up to this point. This is insane A-gap pressure. Oftentimes, you get A-gap and edge pressure um, out of the nickel triple formation. I think the nickel triple is one of the best defenses in the entire game for several different reasons, and this is just one another one of the reasons that makes this so so dang effective so let's jump into the video here we're going to come out in any play out of nickel triple it could be any play now the play that i like to use the most because it, it requires the least amount of setups uh from this formation is either the cover three or any of the nickel blitzes so nickel blitz three hot blitz three um any of those plays the nickel blitz three any of those plays i really really like so uh in this example we're going to show you um let's just grab the nickel blitz two i think nickel blitz two is probably good because we're going to send a lot of pressure and we're going to force them to have to get rid of the ball quickly so a cover two defense is going to be a very effective tactic now uh real quick before we go any further i do want to let you know that i have an entire defensive guide devoted to the nickel triple i think this is one of the most fascinating defenses in the game it's probably the favorite defense i've had so far it's very fun to run and it's also very dang good uh, against a lot of the meta offenses in this game so nickel blitz two we're going to show you how to send some absolute crazy pressure out of this play and honestly it's really really simple setup now all we're going to do uh with this what i like to do is i like to show blitz and you're going to see that it's going to bring this slot corner right off this edge then what we're going to do is we're going to globally blitz our linebackers just like this and then what i like to do is i like to take this guy and man him up on the running back that's going to take away a lot of the flat passes and quick passes that a lot of people like to use uh, out of this out of this uh play so you see here we're going to be sending some pretty significant pressure but for, watch what's going to happen snap the ball you're going to see you're going to get absolutely crazy freaking pressure at the quarterback let's jump into his replay and break this down this is insane and again the setup's so simple um so literally watch i mean this is this is insane insane pressure so uh at the snap of the ball you're gonna see you're gonna stand here i hold left trigger for just a second and then come down and then i go into coverage and as you see this is insane this is insane look at how good this pressure is you get a gap pressure nose tackle defensive tackle a gap pressure and you get edge pressure coming off of that looper from the nickel blitz okay so let me show you this again it doesn't always come from the edge as well but most of the time it will so again we're going to show blitz you don't have to show blitz but i like to because i feel like it puts us in a better better position across the board uh so then we're going to globally blitz our linebackers the key is that middle linebacker looping in i think that's one of the most important things about this defense and then we're going to take that left of screen linebacker in the in the b gap and man him up on the running back so again snap of the ball and what you're going to see is there's your a gap pressure you're either going to get it from your looper or your nose tackle one of the two it's coming right down the middle and that is the beauty of this defense. It's so good. Um, you don't have to even come down into the gap. If I stay back here like this, sometimes it even makes the blitz better. That time my nose tackle fell down, but the pressure is still coming in. And again, this is such a good defense. Now, if you want to, another tactic that you can do is you can QB contain off the edge. So you see here, I'm going to QB contain. And what that's going to do is it's just going to make this blitz angle even better from that slot corner. It's going to make it wider, more likely for him to loop around the edge. And so we'll show that one more time. And again, we're going to just contain. Now, if you want to get the entire defense, like I said, there's a link in the description of the video. But as you see there, I mean, nose tackle, A gap. Now, uh, one thing really quickly to point out is if you are playing an ultimate team and you put unpredictable on your user it's going to significantly help the blitz okay it's going to significantly help the blitz the cool part about this as well is you can drop either person off that left side it doesn't have to be the inside linebacker so for example let's say i want to drop the outside linebacker because he's in a better position okay well i'll just drop him in coverage and as you see now we're going to come from the other a gap pressure okay so this defense is very 
Um, it's just very adaptable. And to be honest with you, it's probably my favorite blitz in the game right now because literally it's so good. Look how fast that comes in. Look how fast that comes in. If they don't block anybody, it's instant sack. It's instant sack. You're coming right down the middle. Again, let me show it to you one more time. And I like said, if you stand right here, you're going to pretty much guarantee the A-gap. So you see there, there's double A, double a gap pressure. Like, how can you not like this? Now, let me um, let me unpack a couple of adjustments the offense can make. So one of the adjustments the offense can make is they can block their running back. So I want to show you what this blitz looks like when they block their running back. So if they block their running back, as you see, your A-gap pressure still comes in. You're still getting A-gap pressure even when they block a running back. I think that's crazy. I think that is so good. And then the next thing is, so obviously if they block the running back, you're still getting a gap. Now, what if they delay fade their tight end? So they delay fade the tight end, and the delay fade does, for the most part, pick this up. But I will say there's other blitzes out of the nickel triple that the delay fade will be significantly worse against. Okay? And if you're even struggling with a delay fade, then just leave that linebacker blitzing, and you're still going to get double A-gap pressure, as you see right there. Disengage pressure is what makes the nickel triple so, so, so effective. And, you know, oftentimes I will say you will occasionally get a disengage if they block their tight end. It's not 100% that they're going to pick this up because oftentimes there you saw he kind of fought through. And some of that is, again, I want to be really clear, make, make sure you're putting the unpredictable ability on your um on your nose tackle. If you put that unpredictable ability on him, it's going to significantly help the chance that you're going to get a gap pressure. And again here, as you see that time, we blocked the tight end and we got edge pressure. So you're going to get some pressure, I promise you. And before long, they're going to be max protecting. I guarantee that they are going to be max protecting against this blitz. And you're going to find, what could this blitz against max protect? You get looping a gap pressure. So this is honestly, right now, probably my favorite blitz in the game because how can you argue with this right here? There's no other formation in the game that I've seen that is this consistent at getting pressure from the A-gap. The nickel triple gives you some of the best A-gap blitzes that I've ever seen. Um, so this is like since like Madden 13 stuff. I mean, this is insane A-gap pressure that you're going to consistently get from this. And again, it all comes back to your user. But look at the note. Look at the look, there's three people coming completely clean at the quarterback. So this defense is so much fun. If you want to learn the full version of the defense, how to actually run this uh, as a complete defensive scheme, how to learn other pressures that are even better than this one right here, there's a link in the description. You can get the entire defensive ebook for literally just $15. For just $15, we're going to show you how to use the nickel triple against every single offense in the game. And we're also going to, that is, that is competitive. And we're also going to continue to update this guide as we find new pressures, as we find new concepts. But I had to share this blitz with you. I think this is the best blitz in the game right now. It's insane. He got pressure, double A got pressure and edge pressure is insane and you're going to come in if they're max protect they, 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 this blitz is coming in and so my favorite blitz right now thanks for watching the video if you want to get the full defense there's a link in the description below if you thought this blitz was good we have even better stuff in the defensive ebook and like i said you guys are going to have a lot of fun with this defense it's so 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 effective so go get it it's 15 bucks links in the description go down click that link takes you right to the website where we'll get you all squared away